Alright, so, as Pastor Mark just said, we've given you a lot of tools already. But now we'd like to give you the tool to be able to share the gospel message in a way that it's easy for you to remember. Then, when that's done, we're going to tie it all together in one nice little scenario. So first thing we have to remember is, as Mark started in the very beginning, in the beginning, we had a relationship with God. When we were created, we were in union with the Trinity, like this. This is us. We're in union. This is David, or this is Adam and Eve in the garden. They had union with God. They walked with Him every day. When Adam and Eve sin, sin into the world and it broke that relationship. So now, we are separated from our Heavenly Father. Right? We're separated. <laughs> and no matter how hard we try, we can't regain that relationship. Right? Because in Romans it says, um, for the wages of sin is death. The gift of God is eternal life. So when, when sin entered the world, we were separated from our Heavenly Father. <coughs> And no matter how hard we try, no matter how good we are, no matter how many things we give to the poor, that relationship, that relationship is never able to be never get that finger to go back into your hand. There's no way we can work our way into heaven. Because the wage of sin is death. <laughs> what is a wage? It's a wage. You can do work and you get payment, right? That's your wage. So you're so your wage for sin is death. But eternal life isn't a wage. Eternal life cannot be earned. You can't work hard enough to get into heaven. It is a gift of God. So the wages of sin is death. That relationship that was whole was broken with sin. But Jesus came and he died on the cross. 
Provisu Chris Aunu Bayo, Rawan Kusma Mornu Bayo. He died. Anima Mornu Bayo, yes, who's buried. And it is Massima Gadi Nuayo. And he's raised again. And if very one minute to go to Mori Nuayo. And in that, Jesus offers us a gift. One day, two or three galleys say, I know, all of the Zivan Dinuayo. Also says in Romans, while we were yet sinners, Christ died for us. And in Romans 10, verses 9 through 10, it says, um, it, For with your heart you believe. Sorry. Um, yes. Yes. Yes, 19. Because if you confess with your mouth, Jesus is Lord. And believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead. You will be saved. Because with your heart, the one believed and is justified. And it's with your mouth, the one confesses and is saved. So when Jesus came, died on the cross, was buried, and was raised again. He gave us a gift. That all we have to do is accept it. And when we do, that connection is remade. And we're brought back into a relationship with God. <coughs> Right. So then we come into our ten fingers. And this helps us remember. Right. Okay. We're going to start with our left hand. Right. Jesus Christ. Jesus. Uh, yeah, Jesus Christ. Died for my sin. Right. Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ died for my sin. Yeah. Yeah. Do it again. Hello, Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ died for my sin. Yeah. 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 And the other hand. Right? Ani. And Ra Ani 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 Mrityu Bata Bata Ani 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 Ani, 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 Ani,